Hello, this is Krillian, and welcome to episode 37 of my Let's Play Total War Warhammer 2 as the Dark Elves on Legendary Difficulty. Um, we are quickly approaching the death of all of the of the Elves, or High Elves. Uh, we have... Cruel Dreadlord! We have done pretty massive damage to them. Let's pick up your thing. Can I get you anything cool? Get that, because money is important. Um, we are almost done with the High Elves. So, what I think I'm going to do with the High Elves, because it doesn't, if I, if, although they may just unite with um, the other ones, but I basically am going to pick one little dinky region, maybe Mistnar, and then leave them there sacked and just keep sacking them. That way they are still in the game, they'll help if other people reach the end point, and we won't have to worry about them. Over here. This is quickly becoming an issue. My knows no limits. Sharmal! We are displeased. Dark and noble warrior. Dreadlord! Okay, they've moved. Now down here, I kind of went back and forth on if I wanted to Black go after Moors, and I think the answer is it's worth going and stopping Moors. And having one army just kind of conquer stuff down here. The the Skaven are not incredibly powerful. Sending one army by itself is kind of silly, but yeah, I'd rather not let anyone ever get this point. Oh, they've already lost Mouth of Quitsa. That is great. They cannot regain that within the next four turns, and I think all their armies have been sent north to deal with me, then they fell at their thing. This is what you get for just sending your dinosaur hordes at me, bozo. Um, there is I cannot build what I want here yet. Get public border going. I don't want to spend money on that. The air is thick with murder. Build that because I want this region to hold. We have to come and deal with that, but we need to kill all of them. So my goal is to finish Lothurn off here, or to leave them with just one place, so that my other army can leave, and then I'll just leave one army there in case the scaling or aghol or whatever get uppity, and then. We're going to send more armies down to invade down here. Call to Pleasure is actively beating up on people, which is good. Dreadlord, I really just want to join with you. With me is precious, so make known I will pay you every penny I have. I can't do that yet. I'll join war against them soon enough. Morath, I have a great many things to see. Uh, have a gift. For Kane. I just have to keep boosting it because some they 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 cheat basically. Is the long and short of it, and so I just cannot keep up with them. Um, somewhere out here, you... Dreadlord of the Druki, Go pick that one up first. Wait. Then we'll make our way down. Okay, let's look and see if we can make money. You make money. Um... We'll hold off on walls until I know I can't make any money. Um, that adds public order and a garrison. Or I can work on getting up the dragons here. But I can't recruit them from a distance, so yeah, we'll just do that. That'll help with public order. Um, that's good for now. Uh, that makes money. I really need this to be apparently fourteen or 15,000 to build another army. 
We tried to build another army and found it failed us miserably. Two more turns and then we can build a walls and a public order building here. Both of which are pretty needed. Um, build that. Build money. Because this region's actually going up. We're doing fine there. Grand. No, I don't have the money for that. Hero. You are really not very useful. Can't even do that. Okay. Yeah. So we will push to to just basically destroy Lothar. And then when Lothar is basically gone or for all intents and purposes gone, we will uh send the other army out. We need to get rid of both gates, because gates they can recruit nice stacks at. We need to take them down to one minor settlement that we can just spank repeatedly over and over again. So they hold one, two, three, four, five, six. I don't think that's them. They're only supposed to have five. Hexodal, are you going to come play? I don't care if they go, nope, they're not. They brought another army in. If we can get the Hexodal, we take Hexodal, though. And we can hold Hexodal with, with one of our armies. Or with, against their stuff. So we just need to get to Hexodal, crush it, and then move on. One of Munza Mundi has nothing but freaking dinosaurs too. Kind of makes me want to play them and just have them have endless ar armies of dinosaurs and just run rampant over people. Uh, of course, the computer probably knows how to crush them. You're gonna come in here. We will have to fight this manually. What is their range? 180. Ours is not nearly as good. Um, once we've once we've used up our archers, we should be able to crush them with what we have left. Um, but we're not going to do that victory. quite yet. Let's just see all the places we let them know. Death touch. Okay, so that region no would definitely battle. revolt, and so we're going to come here. Which stops it from revolting. And next turn, that will be built. And so we can continue our march north. Enya Vries. We need public order. Uh, money. I would love to have that. I can't. That's not very useful. That reduces the issues with slaves eventually. I don't need the can. I think I need that more. Public order here. Not very good. Not good at all. Okay. Down in this part of the world. Tyrant. Okay, coming. This is a fool's errand. Oh, we missed that, but that's fine. I'm betting Dawn's Light has Gaven. Still, it might be worth hitting Dawn's Light if there's nothing closer. Four turns. So Dawn's Light... I don't, I don't think there's another one here, so I'm probably going to hit Dawn's Light and take that. 
And that gives me a place to rest up before going into their main settlement. Mouth of Quetzera has been taken. They do have a full stack here, so that's not great. We cannot depend upon that then. You. Buff that up. See if we can keep this. Don't send slaves here. Um. What lies are you get out of that noble purpose? Chosen of Cain. Okay, you're gonna hit them. No mercy. Now this actually should not be as bad as it's telling us it will be. But why would we take one army in when we have two? Vicious warrior. Conquest lies ahead. You. I wonder how expensive these dinosaurs are. Maybe 500 each? Maybe 300 for these? 500 for the really good feral carnosaurs? But I mean, that's an ex that just looks like it's an expensive army. Okay. So we have we this battle here. Let me just make sure... Basically, we're going to fight one fight. Is probably what we have time for this episode. So I'm just checking to see if there's anything else I need to do. This region, even up. Although chaos corruption is growing stronger. Ariel. Go kill! I really don't have much use for you. I'm just gonna disband you. I've wasted way too much money on you. Okay. Um. Yeah, I still want you to come up and get whatever that is. You can't quite make it, but it is okay. Okay, so. I think we do the one that matters the most. And that is. Malekith. So if we take Hexadol and hold it, admittedly they have quite a bit they can throw at us because there is another army somewhere around here as well. But if we take Hexadol and hold it, then um, they fell again. And falling again is wonderful. Shipwreck. So... Glorious carnage! First, can you... What awaits me? No, you can't. Okay. Now, somehow, it's about the same as it was before. I am not going to control the large army because I want these archers and stuff. Um, I just kind of have to hope. Can I see where we're coming in on this map? No. Oh, and this is a terrible one. I have to hope that we're coming in from close to one side or the other. Otherwise, it's going to be really lame for these guys. But I can have them drop their stuff and just run and then blow up towers and come get them. Or just use, you know... I don't know if she has her dragon. I don't think she does. Um, still, I think controlling the large army makes the most sense. So, Fight for me or die. Because if I could bring in all the archers Come to me to battle. without it, it would be worthwhile. But I can't. And this I really want to kill as much of this as I can with archers before uh, I, I go and I send my troops in to deal with them in melee. Regardless of how well we'd be able to deal with it in melee, that's a problem. So we're going to pause. We'll be right back to crush Ten Fi. Okay, here we are at the battle. Our troops are coming in over here. It's awesomely what we needed. Okay. That makes this so much better. 
She has a bunch of uh, the actual bows. Because he has four of these. I, I really should just take time to get rid of them. Okay. You are just going to sit right here for now. Um, we will gamble because we're under 13 and his spells are actually pretty awesome. And we got that. So we can start our deployment. We have no one left over here. I fought a battle the other day and left two units in a bad place and it was very sad to me. Okay. Cold-blooded killers! Blow that. Forward! On to slaughter! I forget if he has healing Ready potions or not. Moving out! Okay. Onward! Get over here. Get over here. Does he have a potion of healing? He does. Cool. So I'll just leave him sitting here as all these dudes come in. Battle calls. He's taking like no damage. Which is very good. By your command. Murder awaits. How are we doing at blowing this up? 75%. The fact our troops came in where they did is awesome. Druki! Dealers in death! Blood will flow! Okay, that takes care of that. Okay. Now they do have some infantry. Don't fire at wall, Will. But I do want you to blow that up. Okay. Now we're gonna fix our our troops. Nagarothi! Black guards! Cold blooded killers! We have a ton of black guard. You're dread spears, you can come over here. You two can come over here. Uh Brookie! Dark shards! We are ready! We have lots of dark shards. Dark shards! Cold-blooded killers! How are we doing here? Almost done. Okay. You guys come up to here. Dark shards! You guys come to here. Now this may be a lengthy battle, but we do want to try and do it well. Moving out! Okay. Setting forth. You get over here. Druki. Bolt throwers. You guys knock that down because I have a lot of forces here, and I don't want to deal with it. Thirty-three in the first one is pretty good. Come kill this king cohort, because that's hilarious. If that's if they're not gonna put anyone up here but a king cohort, we'll just go kill the king cohort. Once we clear the walls, it'll be great. E three. Set by. My words. Kada! All shall tremble. Malik. What is all these skink priest avatar? Glorious carnage! Malekith comes! Forward! It is done! Come forth! Fear me!
kill this king priest. Oh, he may be summoned for. Trade! What is this? Uh. Kill this gink cohort with javelins. Bride of Cain! You guys, climb up and help kill this. Antsy, so don't. Dealers in death. You guys, come up. Carnage awaits. Forward. Destroy. We're letting them do all their summons and stuff on the walls. We're getting a lot of spells off. Cut off. That did not do a whole lot. He is getting a ton of kills. Let's go a little bit faster. Okay, you guys. Again, these are obsolete units, so I don't mind sucking their ammo up. It's better than throwing stuff at... at, uh... Our leader. Okay, we need to start getting him out of there. Okay. Go do that to the temple guards. You guys fire at the temple guards. He has killed over 200 already. They're not killing a lot of the temple guard, but that's okay. Okay. Four of you come up. Don't fire at will. Don't fire at will. You guys. Can you all fire here? Let's kill this King Cohort. Drop that in there. Breathe on these Soros Warriors. Oh. Use your healing potion. I'm pretty sure it's not going to max out. Okay, you guys, back off. Um, oh, that poor unit got wrecked. Okay. Three of you. Get up on the wall. Okay, you guys. Come in right here. I want you to fire in there at will and wreck stuff. Okay, kill these kings. You, you're supposed to be up here too. You on a mount or something? Oh, you are. You're on your cold one. Okay, so the hags will have to have all the fun. Um, you. Uh, breathe again. On um, these croc cigar. Fire at these Croxigors, or these Croxigors. Fire at some Croxigors, I really don't care which. Okay, Malicus, I need you to come in here and help with this, because they're having some serious problems.
You guys, get up on the walls. I don't really want to lose my heroes if I don't have to. Don't go into the city. Get up on the walls. Oh, we have temple guards up here. Kill the temple guards. You. Just keep killing, just keep killing. Okay. Four of you come up. Kill this ancient Segadon. Malekith. Help with these temple guards. Okay, you guys, line up here and just shoot down. You guys, kill this. Now go for Coldwell Riders. And we're just going to start using our missile superiority and the control of the walls. Malika. This may not do a lot to, to them. They do have a lot of temple guards, actually. I'm tempted to send him in to go kill... Uh, come kill these Saurus warriors or spears. Malekith, come help with these. Ah! Okay, you guys, fire here at this barrel Bastilodon. You guys, try to kill this barrel Carnosaur. Okay. Now we're fighting temple gods over here. You guys, fire into these temple guards over here. Come forward. Fire here. Uh, you guys, come up and shoot these Pterodon Riders. You. You guys come here. You. You guys come up. I may need your help on the wall. We are losing our our guys. You guys get back. They did spend a lot of temple guards to do that. And now we can shoot our temple guards, the temple guards, but our black arc corsairs are in 
for a world of pain. You guys. Kill this temple guard. Is that a unit that died? Oh, they're rallying? Over there? Get over here then. Okay, we'll just spend ammo killing these. All of you guys. Guess we'll do this. Uh. Kill this. You. Charge in here. These are not good against him. So we might as well use him to smash as many Temple Guard as we can. Because I don't really want him fighting the big monsters. I'd rather use my Nagaron for that. Okay. We've almost killed off all the pterodons. Okay. All of you guys fire at these horn ones. What do we have left here? Not a ton. You can just withdraw from the battle. You stop being there. Okay. You guys fire at these Croxigors. Because they're anti infantry craziness. And they can be shot easily. Okay. Where are you? You can withdraw from the battle before I do anything else. Okay. Do I think there's anything else that can get on the walls? Probably not. So all of you guys hop up on the walls. And we'll find out if I'm wrong. If I'm not, it will be kind of wonderful. You come to here, you fire at will. You step up to here, fire at will. You come here, fire at will. You fire here, you fire there. You fire here. Come up here. Okay, that works. All of you guys, kill this Sparrow Carnosaur next. If we don't have to fight them in melee, our life will be much easier. You. Whatever. Uh, come over here. You too. Come right here. You guys had an ammo? Okay, where are you guys? I want all of you. 
Okay, so you guys are almost out of ammo. So I need you guys to come stand on these dead bodies. You over here. You. You try to kill it. Oh, we won! Yay! Now, some of our units to get wrecked. But overall, that was very good. Close victory. Really? We didn't even expend our best infantry. We did lose a lot. Mainly, I, I was careless with these guys. But I really do think that obsolete. I'd be better off with just getting normal infantry. Or more Nagarond. Maybe some Hydras or Giant. Or, um, Dragons. Having some Dragons might be good. Okay, we're gonna pause and we'll be right back. Okay, we are back. We got nearly 8,000 in cash. They died. Oh, that's annoying. Uh, he died. That's fine. He died. I'm probably going to give, uh, take some of her stuff and then have her go rebuild. Um, so losing the number of units we did, uh, I didn't realize these two had just died, died. Oh well. Swell my profits. That was a lot of money. And this is a very good settlement to hold. I am beyond defeat. You. Yeah. The buildings are crumbling. Okay, we obviously need that desperately. That is worth doing because it brings a ton of money that we need. We can get hydras. Interesting. Um, Stellar Pyramids of the Southern Skies. That one's pretty good. Can't get it yet. Um, repair that just cause and do this. <gasps> cool, I can get Blackguard here. I don't need to repair that. That's that's awesome. Undefeatable. What does my garrison here look like? Non-existent. My but my no army's limits. pretty good. I have dark purpose. What lies ahead? I don't see. Oh, his their army went there. Magic. He can't reach it. He can. Druki nobility. But so we're gonna Everywhere stick with ruined. that. And now they've lost two of the three, so they're really not gonna be able to finish. Okay, so we're gonna end the episode here. Um, I think that overall we're doing pretty good. We're now making close to that. This settlement made us a lot of money, um, which almost lets us build that third army that I've been wanting to, our next army I've been wanting to build. I just don't know if I'll where I want to build it. Now, when they attack, <laughs> it's gonna be painful. But I have brought them ruin. I think, uh, with, with all our, our uh, guys, our Blackguard of Nagrand were unhurt, and they are armor-piercing anti-large. None of these are anti-infantry, other than this unit. But I think our Blackguard should be like Crush Temple, Temple Guard. And they're not going to be really good at getting up on the walls. So if they come at us, we should be pretty good. Okay. Um, you have lightning strike. Get a dark pegasus so you're flying, and then a black dragon will be next for you. Oh, I hopefully she's immortal. And they died, they weren't, they're not just injured, right? 
Yeah, they're dead, dead. I have brought the them buildings ruin. are crumbling. Um, we could get sorceresses here, canine assassins, and death hags. Really, the death hag replenish troops thing is pretty good. I may put one in both armies. Everywhere. You. Start recruiting a, a Hydra. I think a Hydra or two would not be bad. <sighs> Harpies sound so bad. They don't seem good at all, but... Well, we'll, we'll do a Hydra. Hydra will be able to ha um, take on some of the big dragons. And we have to sit here for a few turns anyways. Dreadlord you. At your command. Get more of those. I don't know if we'll have the time to recruit, but we'll try. There's destruction everywhere! Okay, so we're going to end the episode here, as we have another battle to do next time. We'll be fighting the battle at Eagle cool Gate. This one should just be a matter of shooting them all down. We have a lot of range, um, and we don't necessarily have to do it. We can back off if it becomes... If we don't do enough damage. They only have four melee troops though. And uh, the rest of them will fall pretty heavily against them. So we should be able to do it. So for now, like and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave below. Otherwise, I'll talk to you later. Adios.